Hello everyone, welcome to Foxtag again. This time we talk about Siri on the Apple Watch. How do you change the voice, how you download another Siri voice on your Apple Watch? So, of course, I will explain to you everything, but at first, you need to make sure that when you go to the Watch app on your iPhone, on the iPhone which is paired to that specific Apple Watch, you need to make sure that Siri is actually enabled. For me, it's not, so I'm gonna turn it on when pressing the digital crown, so let's enable Siri. And you have the option, once you turn it on, to show Siri responses, which shows you like a bunch of things which you can do, but it doesn't show anything in regards to the voice and the voice and the accent Siri uses on the iPhone compared to the Apple Watch is different. The setting is not synced. It's not like you choose something for iPhone Siri that it's going to be automatically applied to the Apple Watch Siri. So on the Apple Watch, once the Siri is enabled, all you have to do is to go to the settings there and scroll down to find the Siri section on the watch. So tap on it. So you can see that the same options are showing up. So listen to the stuff, press digital crown. But if you scroll down, you also have the language and Siri voice. So if you tap on language, you have all of the languages here available. That means that you can browse through all of them and choose the one that you want. So you can see you have English with multiple different accents or locations. So choose whatever you want. I have the English United States, so that's what I have chosen. But if you come back, you also have the Siri voice and you can choose from all of these sounds as well and voices. So you have most options for English. By the way, guys, if you want to know everything about your iPhone apps, you have to click the link down below in the description. It's a 100% free education platform where I publish like video editing courses. There is going to be the All Apps Explained course, which is coming up. It's going to explain every single app on your iPhone. It's going to be really cool. So go ahead and check out that link. It's free to access. So yeah, go ahead and do that right now. So yeah, you can also get have like a show or preview or what it's going to sound like. Now, after you, after you click on that, you need to make sure that the rounding icon, the, the loading stuff is finished. That's how you know that it's been downloaded. You can see that I have a passcode, so it just resets it. But after you do it, after it's going to be downloaded, of course, once you click it, the download process starts automatically. So all you have to do is just to wait until everything is going to be finished. So that's the important part. So... You go like this or choose any other accent, but that's basically how you can change and download Siri voices on the uh, Apple Watch. It's kind of unusual that you don't have the option on the iPhone on the only on the watch, but once you choose it, the language is going to be chosen and it's going to be downloaded on your Apple Watch by extension. So that's about it. That's everything what I wanted to show you and explain in this video. I really hope that you found this video useful. If you did, I would really appreciate it if you hit the thumbs up. Subscribe down below because you definitely want to stay part of the videos in the future. You don't want to miss the future uploads. And we can see each other then. Thanks a lot. Peace out.